Uh, welcome everyone. This is episode 103 of Shop with Diane, a show that comes to you live on Facebook and YouTube and can be watched as repeats anytime. It's coming to you from my store, Take a Hike at Take Two Boutique, which is located here in Thunder Bay. And this show has just been an unexpe unexpected um, surprise through the pandemic because forced into being innovative, uh, decided to try to reach out to uh, you when you were locked down. And uh, oh my goodness, people have come back every week to watch the show as I've been having a chance to introduce people to now it's been over a thousands of products that I have available here at my store that you are able to order during the show or after the show or while the store is open come by and pick those items up however the pandemic has been pretty tough and we're doing all sorts of pivoting and uh, rethinking business models so um and what I'm doing is I'm going to close my storefront in on uh, the last day will be June 11th. We're trying to clear out all of our um, clothing because I'm getting out of that business. But uh, right now we have women's spring and summer wear at 40% off and we will have um, our fall winter stock at 50% off. And if you've been waiting for those prices to come down even further, you're going to wait a long time. Those are the bottom prices that I'm able to do without uh, losing a lot of money. So that's not what I'm in business to do. I just, I'd like to break even on this if I can. So come on into the store. And we have had people make a trip up from Duluth to get to the, to um, the store clearance sale. And uh, thank you to Kelly and Annette who made that trip up and uh, very much appreciate it. So the show tonight, we're going to focus on a number of men's products because Father's Day is coming up and we've kind of been ignoring um, some of the men's items that we have in the store. Over the years, our store, Take a Hike, used to carry all sorts of men's products, but uh, uh, we rebranded to Take Two Boutique and sort of they uh, sort of shown the door a little bit, but we do have some great products to show you this evening that remain available. And um, what else is coming up? There's graduations and there is end of school coming up. And tonight in Ontario is the Ontario election. So I really appreciate those of you who have gathered around uh, for the live show. There's just so much to do and the weather is finally feeling a little bit like spring. So um, yes, so, let me get started. I'm going to show you some products. If you're interested in the uh, pur purchasing them in the comment section, please claim those items. In some cases, they are very limited. After the show, we'll get just reconfirm on um, in the comment section whether those items are available and organize when it will be that you'll come and do a store pickup. Or um, let me put the hours that we're going to be open for the next. Um, next little bit uh as i said it's been a bit of a scramble to get tonight's show together so if i have a little hesitation here you'll forgive me i'm sure so uh we will be open uh monday no we're closed monday so tuesday wednesdays and fridays 11 to 5 saturday 11 to 4 that's until june 11th and let me just pull that away and um Okay, so, okay, let's get going. Um, so, episode 103, focusing on men's, um, men, but us gals would like some of these gift ideas, I, um, ideas as well. A year ago, the Thunder Bay Field Naturalist came out with this product, and it's the Thunder Bay Nature Guide. It says 2001, but nothing really has changed, and it's been many, many, many years back that they did a previous edition. This is into its third print, it's so that's fantastic. Uh, what it is, is it shows you 30 different uh, outdoor locations in and around Thunder Bay that are um, really wonderful to explore at any time of the year. And uh, it is going to show you, um, Let's see, it's going to give you directions on how to get there. And uh, it's going to explain the key features in that area. It talks about the plants and the birds, 
the flora, the fauna, the geology. It's just filled with all sorts of places to venture off to. So if you don't have a copy, you're going to want to get one. It's just $25. And um, you may also be uh, planning a visit to Thunder Bay. And this would be a great way to explore it. Or maybe you're playing host to people that will be coming. Send them advanced copy and maybe they can sort out uh, some of the places that they would like to um, explore while they're visiting you. So uh, this is product number one on tonight's show. I'm going to get back into the comment sections. Okay. And, um, and Tracy's joining us. So um, we do notice too, people are watching us uh, on the Shop with Diane YouTube channel as well. And uh, they don't come up on our number counter on Facebook, but we'll have others uh, in the wings as well. So product number one, the Thunder Bay Field Naturalist Guide. Product number two is new. Oh my God, I'm excited to show it to you. I tried to order it earlier in the year, but uh, there wasn't any stock available. And I just got a shipment today, this afternoon. So I'm pretty excited about it. What is this? Can we focus on this? It's from uh, um, it's from SOL, which means Survive uh, Outdoors Longer. Is the company? It's the Firelight Fuel Free Plasma Lighter. Well, it's a rechargeable lighter. Looks like this out of the package. And um, let me explain it to you. This is pretty cool. So it comes with a little USB cable so that you can charge this unit. So it um, provides an electrical arc. It's electrical shock that actually is go, um, going to start a fire. So what you do is, well, first of all, there is a light. Hmm. It was working before. <laughs> Let me just open this. Well, I won't show you the light right off. So I just pop, I open up this little clasp to unlock this, press this open. And can you see this? This is the top of the unit. There's four little um, uh, points there. And I don't know if it's going to be visible on the screen, but when I press here, this little black button, well, you can see that. Look at that. There's an electrical charge. So what you would just do is have that touch your uh, birch bark, your um, shavings, whatever you're using to, as an igniter, and you just touch that, and it starts a fire. <laughs> so um, that's shocking, isn't it? It's pretty cool. And um, on... What am I doing that I haven't figured out the, okay, the flashlight. <laughs> there is a flashlight on the other end and there are um, three, three settings. There's a bright light, a lighter light, and a strobe light. So um, it also has a lanyard, which is a paracord. It's three feet of paracord. If you were to, if you were to pull the threads back, in the center of it is a cotton, a wax cotton, um, uh, not cord that you could use as an igniter as well. So that's really handy to have. It's rechargeable. As I said, it'll work in any weather in any altitude so in the winter it's going to work it's going to work in the wind which is going to be fantastic it is waterproof and it will when when fully charged which will take about uh, two hours to fully recharge it will give you three um 300 seconds of ignition or on the low beam three hours of light so some are saying this is about going to start 45 fires that way. Um, pretty amazing. So this is a cool survival gadget. Why I'm showing it on tonight's show with men in mind is my 25 years of experience in retail 
I've come to realize that men like gadgets. <laughs> so um, here's a, a great one. And the price of this is just $34.95. So a great gift for yourself, if you wish, if you're um, just about anyone. But um, I think it'd be making a great gift for any outdoors person. And uh, that's product number two on Shop with Diane. Um, there's other ways to make fires. And uh, we have in that shipment that arrived today, another supply of the storm proof matches we had run out. And why people have been picking these up is because these are quite amazing. Uh, this match here, the wooden match, comes in a box with it has some use uh, uh, strikers on the side but it also has inside uh, some spare strikers if you struck this this is going to burn for 15 seconds and uh, that's a long time that's probably long enough to get my birthday cake uh all the candles lit without uh, burning my fingers so um this is going to be uh there are 25 in a package of these and they are even, um, if you submerge this in water and took it out, it's going to reignite. How do I know that? I was out of my store and uh, while I was out one day years back, an employee, when I returned, was very excited saying, hey, Diane, we like lit one of those matches. And we went to put it out in the water and we took it out and it came back to life. So that's how I know that. <laughs> it's, uh, I love the curiosity of... Uh, of anyone and workers so I was not at all upset with that I thought that was um pretty cool and thank you Heather for your order for that um uh firelight lighter the electric lighter so um I'll make sure I have one set aside for you so the stormproof matches uh we were selling them earlier in the season in a waterproof container but the company is sold out of those the distributor so we have them this way which you may need to find your own waterproof container, but the price of these are $11.95. So that's product number three. Product number four, since we're going to be maybe starting a fire, a campfire, that made me think about ah, oh, this product, the extendable barbecue fork to cook some hot dogs or marshmallows. And um, let me just show you one. So these are just little protective covers, but this will extend, oh my goodness, how many inches? Uh, it says centimeters, so almost 25. It goes from 25 centimeters till 84 centimeters, so quite a reach. And um, these are just priced at $7.95. People love to have a campfire and love to cook roast something, whether it's hot dogs or sausages or marshmallows, you know, making s'mores in the summer with that chocolate and um, marshmallows and graham cr crackers. Isn't that delicious? So um, this would be great. Grandchildren might be coming to visit you this summer and uh, you may want to get each one of them this. It comes it, with different colored handles, it comes with the red handle, blue handles, black handles, green handles, purple. So several to choose from. Uh, and uh, that's product number four on tonight's Shop with Diane. Oh my goodness, people can't see it, but uh, I know that people are watching right up there. Look at that. What is that? I think somebody hit a, um, it, what during the live show, we see how many people are watching and how many thumbs up and hearts. And there's an angry face, but I'm sure it was just a little misstep there. Um, we'll clear that up later in the show, I'm sure. Um, so carrying on, we have um, another extendable product. And over the years, this product, men are pretty proud when they discover one of these in the store because it seems that uh, they've been looking for something like this. And what is this? This is a bear claw back scratcher. And it too extends and makes it real easy to scratch one's own back. And if you 
if you're tired of scratching someone's back, you can make them self-sufficient this way. And um, uh, what have some of our past customers told us is that this also is great to have in your purse, ladies, um, when you're grocery shopping. So you can reach the items off the top shelf at the grocery store because somebody taller than you might not be around. And um, these two come in different color handles green black blue and red so the price of this is just 8.95 you know wouldn't grandpa like one of these for uh, maybe father's day um or just have one of these uh, at home and uh let's see um let's see where are we and welcome to anyone who is watching the show uh just joining us now or um watching the repeat and if you're watching the repeat I'd love to get your orders in. What I did before tonight's show is uh, I put my agenda, the prices, the items uh, on a Facebook post and seeing if that's going to help you do some um, sorting out in terms of what it is that you might like to order from the store. So the next item we have is, speaking of bears, um, we have from Counter Assault, we have bear spray and it ha we have it in uh, two ways. Oops, let me just get this. We have a canister sold separately or we have a canister that's in a holster. So bear spray. Now, if bears in this area are black bears and generally they are more afraid of you than you of them. Uh, they don't really want to typically have an encounter with you so what you should do is be aware of when you're in the outdoors that um there there is a possibility of being bear having bears around so if you're all plugged in your ears and listening to music you may not hear the rustling noises <laughs> uh, just be aware of your environment but if you make noise um singing whistling uh, or encountering a bear banging pots and pans, shouting. The bear, once it does see you, um, may go away. But what you're supposed to do is you don't run, um, don't climb trees, you just back out of the way, making sure that the bear has an exit. You don't want to uh, corner a bear. And uh, you're going to back away, making yourself look big and noisy. And um, uh, But should the bear um, start to come very close and become aggressive, you need to have a defense. And so bear spray is a recommended product. And in here, what we have is um, um, capsaicin, I believe it's called. It's the active ingredient in pepper that is really going to sting the bear's eyes and mouth. And it's not going to do any permanent damage to it, but it does give you a chance to flee. So once you purchase this, you remove this uh, um, uh, thing. You know, I'm, if I'm talking to women, we know the thingy. Okay, we remove the thingy. And then what this uh, will do is uh, you'll see here is a glow in the dark uh, protective piece. You would remove that. That allows us to then to press this down. And this is going to shoot. Um, I believe it's thir up to 30 feet in terms of distance. And um, just be a little bit cautious that the wind, oh, the wind was so strong the other day. And if it was blowing towards you, that wind, and you sprayed this, um, it probably come back and get you. But that's usually not the case. So um, we have the counter assault bear spray and um, something that you will want to have if you're going to be venturing outdoors or even at home. Um, some of you are telling me that you have uh, bears um, uh, in the neighborhood uh, coming closer to your homes, and um, you might want to have this. So I have seen some other people joining us as well. Hello, Barb. Hello, Josie. Nice that uh, we can have you join us for the live show. So um, as I said, we have it in the canister. The price of this is $58.95, but if you are interested in having it on your person as you're in the outdoors, a great way to carry it so it's easily accessible, is on a holster. 
it just is secure in there and then there is a piece here can we yeah you can see you can just put it through a belt loop or possibly on the um, hip belt on your pack and that's a safe way to carry it with the holster the price is 64.95 so let me know if bear spray would be something that you'd like to um pick up here at the store and um what else do we have that's a surprise oh i know i think this is really cool and we have had oh, not just us here in thunder bay which if you're not from the area you may not know thunder bay is where my store take a hike and take to a Boutique is located and has been for the last 25 years. We're on the north shore of Lake Superior in northern northwestern Ontario. And um, but just looking, my goodness, the people of Ottawa who've been out, they were out without power for over a week, some of them more. Barry, if you're watching, you were saying your mom in uh, Pickering was out for four days without power. And um, Allison was telling me that she was up north and they were without power on another occasion. What do we do in terms of trying to um, stay connected with people and getting information? We're so dependent on our smartphones, on tablets, on uh, so many of our electronics. So I know one of um, our customers, because the power went up uh, out up north and does a lot of traveling or just here, has got this product. And what is it? It is a solar panel and it is going to charge a power pack now you can buy power packs to um, charge them but they don't really hold much power to fully charge things like tablets or several charges of a phone but here from um, a company call, called power traveler comes uh, this power unit and they um measure the amount of power that it holds by giving a rating of milliamp hours so this one is 12,000 milliamp hours and that should be sufficient to charge a tablet twice a smartphone three to five times a satellite phone uh, your action camera your head um, we sell some of the headlamps that are rechargeable. Oh my goodness. And you could also recharge this <laughs> from, um, but it allows you to do that because it holds that much power. It's the size of hmm, this size. Okay. And here is the solar panel that will charge the power pack. And um, this can be, uh just set outdoors or strapped onto your backpack if you were in transit it could be on the top of a, a deck of a kayak if you wished many places that you can put this to charge it um, if however you don't have that you can also rely on charging it it with the cigarette uh, lighter in your vehicle and I'm sure they still have, I, I never have used really the cigarette lighter in my lifetime for cigarettes. <laughs> so I, I think my vehicle has one, but um, all sorts of connections here as well. And so to be self-sufficient, to be safe, you might want to pick one of these up. A great gift for dad. Um, maybe you're looking for an anniversary gift for your spouse as well, or a birthday gift price of this for safety is $229.95. So $230 will give your family the type of uh, protection that you would um, want to give. So let me know if you would like one of the um, solar powered, uh, well, what do we call it? The solar kit, the battery solar kit. Let's call it that. So that is on our show tonight. I've got a really long list, so you're going to have to hang in here, folks. Or um, uh, if you have to check out early, come back and watch the rerun. I have got some interesting sales coming up as well. So um, 
Another product came in that I was waiting for. Why am I showing some of these outdoor products? We used to be the store Take a Hike, and we really loved educating people about all sorts of outdoor products, including we had a product similar to this. And this is a rescue flash floating mirror. So what is this about? So what um, you can put a little cord on this so it could attach to a PFD, a personal flotation device, maybe when you're out ca um, canoeing or kayaking, which is a requirement by the Canadian Coast Guard. You also need a signaling device and uh, as a requirement by the Coast Guard on those canoes and kayaks. And this is a signaling device. What it, how you would use it is you would use the sun or the moon as a source of light and you would get a reflection on your hand now. I can't, I've got lots of lights here in the store, but you would get a reflection. Ugh, I can't really do it upside down or backwards, but put your hand up and you put this sort of near your eye and you get a reflection onto your hand and then you tuck your eye behind. In the center here, what you're trying to do is see that um, reflection. But when you look through this end, it's going to be a very bright light. And when it you have it aligned, then anywhere you move, you'll keep seeing that white bright light. But that is exactly where the reflection is going to go. So I could be on one side of a lake and do, do this, and then I can reflect across the lake. Maybe I want to go into the, the window of the camper cottage across the lake to say, hey, help or maybe the airplane that's flying above. If you're stranded in the outdoors, you could signal it that way. You can be very precise with the item like this. The price of this is just, oh, what is the price of this? It's $15.95, so a little gadget. And um, thank you, Josie's saying some great product ideas. Yeah, so these are things that are, uh, really excellent to have, especially if you're enjoying the outdoors or just wanting to become uh, better prepared in case of um, some sort of event that you didn't anticipate. And let's see, what else can I introduce you to? It's going to warm up, people. <laughs> um, and I'm going to need to do another order of this product. It is... I'm thinking about gifts for dad. So if you're just joining us, Father's Day is coming up. So what we have here are we have our really popular heat guards from the company Practical Design. We've been carrying this product for over 20 years in our store, have done well with it every year. And it just grows and grows in popularity. So this product begins... And if you've been watching our show, all 103 episodes, you would have seen this product numerous times. But uh, there's always new people joining us, and uh, they may not be aware of it. So what is this? This is a, um, a cooling necktie, and it is pre-shrunk cotton. These are made in Canada, as I was saying. And it's a tubular piece of fabric, but between this piece between here and here in the center. These are have um, polyacrylamide crystals in them. Now, these crystals are EPA approved. And what they will do when you soak them in water for the first time, say for 20 minutes, they're going to absorb 100 times their weight in water. And when that happens, they puff up. In this case, it's like a sausage, a damp sausage. <laughs> So what you do is you, ooh, you put this around your neck. And why you would do that is because in the area of your neck, your blood vessels very close to the um, surface of your skin. And as this evaporates, the water evaporates, there's a natural, natural cooling effect. And this is going to cool the blood as it runs through your body. So you're going to find great relief. Now, this is going to stay damp and doing its job for the whole entire day. And the next day, if you want to reuse it, you just um, soak it in water, maybe another five, 10 minutes the second day, it'll rehydrate and get to use it again. Say you don't need it the next time, then just allow it to dry out completely and it will return back into this format. 
and ready to use again. Suggested that it can be used 300 times. Now, where would you use it? Not just when it's really, really hot outside, and um, but you might be working in a, a hot environment, uh, a hospital wearing PPE equipment is um, one of our customers uh, relies on these just uh, or a laundry room, a kitchen, a boiler room. You might be a roofer on the roof this summer or working the roads or playing in the heat or having hot flashes, migraines. Um, MS patients have found relief from this, chemo patients, lots of possible uses. The price of these are just $12.95. And if you know a dad who gets hot under the collar, <laughs> maybe he's just a little too warm and uh, could use one of these. So we have them available in many different colorways, and we'll be getting other colors coming through in the summer months. So um, just $12.95 here at the store, and these are the cooling neckties. And um, I know many of you who are watching have this product and have, why don't you, because somebody, you may have commented before in past shows, um, but we are having people join us for the very first time. And I tell them, the new people, oh, you're going to want to watch it in the comments section because people are giving testimonies about how great things are. So if you have anything to say about uh, those cooling neckties, I'd welcome your comments on the show tonight. So um, what else do I have? Uh, dads, okay. Um, I think the ice is mo off the water now. <laughs> it has in... Uh, places and there's been a lot of water so um, people are anxious to get out and uh, do some boating do some fishing um, working around the, um, the the water so what we have here is we have from the local company Xpex we have some polarized floating sunglasses and um, we have a, a, a number of styles that would be suitable for men to wear and um, we also have some women's styles now these are really incredibly lightweight and being polarized there's a um, the way they're manufactured when you're looking at the water you don't see the glare that you normally would on a regular piece a uh, pair of sunglasses and the same being true for snow and um, Here's the one pair that doesn't float. It's the style, but um, have really, really lightweight polarized sunglasses that float. I'm not going to do a demonstration this evening. I haven't done it in the past where I put the pair that doesn't float in the water and it sinks, but I put a pair of floating sunglasses in and they float. It's because the materials they're made out of are less dense than water and that floats. Thank you, Josie, for your testimony about the uh, cooling neckties and um, appreciate that. So uh, floating sunglasses uh, from the company Xpex come into the store and uh, make your selection. The price is $50, um, but for the style that doesn't float, it is $44. So come in and let us know if we can help you. By the way, they do come with a... Uh, a case that can be used as a cleaning cloth as well. And that's a local Thunder Bay company, Xpex. Next we have on the show tonight, ah, uh, I just have one of them. Okay, what is really popular in um, uh, this part of the country, and I, I know a lot of places, is um, kayaking and paddle boarding. And so people are anxious to get out on the water and it's not always warm water, but I have just one of these remaining. And what is this? This is a style. It's a neoprene, uh, three millimeter neoprene, uh, Farmer John style wetsuit. And this one here is a size men's medium. So it's kind of like a small medium. So uh, it can be used for adult male or a teen, a young teen male who's on a bit of a growth spurt. And if this one is made in Canada, I just have one remaining. And the price of it was uh, previously $170. 
clearing it out for a hundred dollars so if you are interested in it if you have a crop of young lads um, in your family who are enjoying getting out on the water doing some paddle boarding kayaking and so on you might want to pick that up just let me know if you're watching the show tonight um, if it doesn't sell tonight and you want to uh, scoot in here and uh, have somebody try it on real quick um, before it is sold by all means we will be open Friday and Saturday this week Friday 11 to 5 Saturday 11 to 4 okay carrying on with tonight's show so that was a big bargain and uh, can we match somebody up with that product the other item I want to show you is another sale item and just have one of them really popular item and uh, what is this we have our final pair of men's Merrill Moab um, trail shoes so this has been over the years our very most popular style of footwear and including Merrill has found that this has been their top selling shoe if you if you see this and you look look around there's a lot of men out there who have discovered these and will um, but uh, they have the stiffness that you're looking for in a pair of shoes that give your body the support they need. Merrill Footwear flexes where your feet naturally bends here, not in the arch. Um, it has a removable insole in it, which is great. If you have orthotics, you can slip those inside, but it's really helpful to keep your shoes smelling fresh if you remove these uh, sweaty insoles at the end of the day. That's really, really helpful. This is, I just have one pair, and uh, Heather says Merrill's shoes last forever. Well, they last a long time, you're right, Heather, but footwear does break down. And um, how do you know that? Is what you do is you grab the uh, toe and the heel of a shoe and you try to twist it in a new shoe it a Merrill shoe it's stiffer after lots of wear it gets soft and your body tells you that it's wearing out as well because slowly you start to get your knees hip you hurt your back hurts uh, you feel more fatigued you get yourself a new pair of these Merrill shoes and you think oh my god yes my old ones were wearing down so um uh, I see somebody's got to run. Goodbye, Anne, and uh, I'm sure you'll catch us on the re one. And um, thank you very much. Uh, Kathy added about the wetsuit. She says it helps you uh, when you're floating, cuts the wind to keep you warm when you're, um, yes, sea doing or boating. So just, I should have mentioned it if you're not familiar with a wetsuit, it is to keep you warmer in those wet conditions and help you float as well. So thank you for adding that. And uh, this is a pair of size men's 11, but they're wide. That makes them hard to find. Most stores hadn't brought in wide footwear, but we did. And what we've discovered of years of experience in selling footwear is quite often people will buy a bigger shoe, a longer shoe, because they're trying to get greater width. Their foot isn't that long. They just needed the width. So if you know of a gentleman who is a men's wide, um, size 11 we have one pair of Merrill shoes they were $140 clearing them up for just 100 shop around you're not going to find them for that price and this is a rare bird <laughs> so um, but size 11 is not a rare sh shoe size for men in this part of the country so uh, it's a pretty typical size just needs to bring some attention to those so um continuing on and it's a busy night our um i know that there is a it's election night in ontario and there's graduations and there is just so much going on so we really do appreciate you joining us for the live show but if you got to run catch us on the rerun as well and um so next item we have as I try to clear some of here's another big sale. Oh my goodness. And speaking of water, I have gators, <laughs> not alligators. These are these are gators. And what's a gator? So here's an old, old boot. Somebody gifted us this old boot when I opened the store 25 years ago, and it was old back then. So there's an old boot. 
But what we've been able to do with a gator is add an extension to it that is going to protect the wearer uh, as they walk through um, the underbrush and it's or the snow and it's going to keep them dry and protected and uh, I'll show you more about these and hmm, I think I'll just take the one off of here so how's everybody doing? I see we have some more people joining us this evening. Welcome to the 103rd edition of Shop with Diane. Uh, I'm in the middle of explaining some products that are available for purchase from my store here in Thunder Bay and um, welcome you. So I'm just showing this product. So it's from Outdoor Research is the brand. If you've been watching the show, you know that Outdoor Research is a company that is the only company that I'm aware of in the industry that offers an infinite warranty on their products. So as long as you hold on to the receipt, uh, you know, the, the original receipt, they will warranty the product. And I see Anne's joined us. Hi, Anne, for the live presentation. So, um, and Anne has been, like a number of you, shopping here uh, on our store closing sale. And I know Anne's found lots of pairs of pants and things. So um, anyways, uh, maybe I shouldn't tell the world. <laughs> but anyways, a lot of you have been doing some great shopping. And if you haven't been down yet, you're one to come in and I keep pulling things out every day. So this is from Outdoor Research. It's called a gator. What you do is you undo this clip at the top. It opens heavy duty Velcro. And there is a strap, a strap on the underside here that you would put uh, together. <laughs> your heel goes in here, and then you wrap this around your calf and secures it. There is a little clip here at the bottom front that clips onto, you know there's shoes, boots that'll have a little metal ring at the bottom of the laces? That's what they're intended for, is so that you can hook this little clip inside. But if you don't have one of those on your footwear, your bottom lace is where you would clip it on. Anyways, this is made by Outdoor Research. We have two different styles, and uh, one is called the Crocodile. And the Crocodile originally was $95. And I'm clearing it out for $50. Okay, pay attention, everyone. Yes, thanks, Mom. It's gonna uh, it's gonna help keep the ticks out. It's gonna help keep the snow out, keep um, uh, with the wet out as well. And so this here is uh, made out of this material here on the front and on the bottom portion. Can you see the difference there? The bottom portion. That's Cordura, and Cordura is very, very durable. It's very hard to even wear that out. That's almost ballistic, and um, that's going to be really strong coverage there. Inside the um, – well, that's maybe a better way to show the difference. So there's Cordura on the bottom portion, but also we have – inside here um you have some nylon on the outside which is really strong and we have here there's three layers actually there is a bit of a mesh here but sandwiched in between is gore-tex gore-tex is a membrane that has micro pores like our skin and water can't permeate from the outside going in but vapor um can uh escape just like our bodies do so this is waterproof and it's highly durable the crocodile this version of it is really designed for people that might be in the bush hard working um, and want that ultimate protection the price of these were normally 95 dollars clearing it out for 50 dollars so that's pretty incredible I just have them though in size extra large and extra large is going to fit a man. You go by your shoe size. So a man who has a 10 to 13 shoe, great gift idea. And uh, 
If you don't have a pair, you will want to get a pair. Those who've not had them and then start to use them will say, oh my God, those are amazing. And so why not pick them up? And I just have a few pairs remaining. I said there were two styles. So um, the other style I have is just, uh, it too has doesn't have the Gore-Tex as the waterproof breathable membrane. Instead, it's called Pertex. Um, which will give you also that uh, breathability, waterproofness. It has heavy duty fabrics, but not that Cordura and uh, just a little lighter weight. This is great for more, most every outdoors person where the other one was for, let's say the outdoor worker. And um, so this here, we have it in the extra large, but where the other was in men's sizing, this is unisex sizing. So uh, what we have is in size extra large, we have it will fit a... I had that backwards. Sorry. It's a real show with a real person who is comfortable with her own errors. <laughs> but um, anyways... This is going to fit a man's shoe 11 to 13 as well, okay? 11 to 13, I have them either in blue or in black in this style. This one was originally $65.95, clearing it out for $35. Now, I can tell I don't have for the live show some really big outdoor enthusiasts because if you were, and maybe I'm wrong here, but if you were, these would just be scooped up instantly in the comment section. So, folks, if you're watching the Ray Run, I'm going to think that I still have some stock left. So you're going to want to pick those up. I have those in size extra large. I also have a pair in size large, which, which would fit as well. A woman sort of size 9, 10 shoe would be okay with the women's lar with the large in that style. So uh, you'll want to pick those up. Other thing though, oh my goodness, some of you gals chuckle when you come into the store and you see me um, with the man in the store and I will say, hmm, I have quite the reputation of getting men out of their pants in my store. <laughs> That's usually um, only one man in many, many years was offended by that comment, but um, I sort of misjudge my audience that day, but um, that's because we have an amazing line of pants from the brand Cool. And um, the other thing I do is I look at the gentleman and I'll say, hmm, if you are a size in your pants, you're maybe 36, 30. And he looks at me and goes, yeah, I am. How do you know that? Well, I just tell him that I, I have a great line of pants and, and I'd like to help them find the right size. Uh, but if a guy ever yelled up my measurements, he'd be in trouble. <laughs> but anyways, uh, the men's cool pants. And uh, men absolutely love these. And they look great in them. This brand, I sell them in three different inseam lengths, 30, 32, and 34 leg inseams. So we could try to size them up that way. Also three girths or uh, there is a tapered lean fit, not a skinny jean fit, but a tapered leaner fit for slimmer gentlemen. On the other end, there's a full or relaxed fit and um, uh, for bigger thighs and buttocks, maybe hockey players, football players, or just because. And then finally, we have one that's a classic fit. So we can get the pants fitting really nicely. They come in different materials as well, some lighter weight, some heavier weight canvases and so on. They look great, but most uncomfortable, most importantly, men love them. And thank you, Gina, um, for putting that comment up. Uh, her husband loves them. And I know a number of you gals um, who shop regularly in the store, your husbands or sons have these as well and can't say enough good things about them. What makes them so comfortable? It's going to be a little hard for me to show you, but most men are really uncomfortable in their pants. And they, um, when they sit down, they have to hike up their pants just to get more comfortable. Uh, when they squat down, 
uh, their knees are pressing so much on the five on the threads in the knees that the breaks down that the, the knees uh, and that's why men's pants are wearing out and then they slip down at the back they're just really uncomfortable so this brand cool has ergonomically designed pants so in the crotch area I don't know if it can show up there in the crotch there is a panel here and it's a gusseted crotch so it gives the gentleman more room to begin with and next we have the legs, but the legs are not straight. The legs are pre-curved or articulated. And that means when they squat down, there is room in their knees and their pants don't slip down at the back. And in the um, waistband, it's just a nice um, comfortable uh, fabric here in the waistband. And it has a really flat and durable snap, a European snap. So they go, they stay done up and uh, they don't cut into the gentleman. They also, in some of the styles in the pockets, will reinforce the pocket the front and the back in some styles so that they don't wear out prematurely. And again, in some styles, this is the bottom of the leg. They'll have a double layer uh, at the bottom so that they don't wear out quickly there. So uh, they're available in, as I said, some different fabrics. This is a lighter weight stretch. There's got lots of pockets to them as well in different styles. And uh, some have a little bit of stretch. So just many to choose from. The brand is cool. And the price of these are going to be reduced. They're around about the $100 regular price, but on sale at 30% off. And um so bring the gentleman in and I will try to do my magic. And uh, it's quite, uh, I've been doing this a long time, folks. And it's quite a shock to many of them where I can just sort of pull up out of many options, the right pair of pants or two, and they fit them right off. So it's not a long process and uh, they really, love the experience so uh, those are our cool pants next thing I have is I'm trying to clear out things because if you ha aren't aware my store is closing the storefront for the purpose of selling clothing and I'm going to want to be transitioning and focusing and developing further this live stream shopping show so until june 11th we are clearing things out at our store in our store so what we have is taking things off the hangers <laughs> and um we have again just only in size small men's small from hatley which is little blue house um we have these awesome awesome boxer shorts and um so they're a men's small so you know teen boys um young teen boys may want a pair of these and um they are a blend of cotton and polyester a uh, cotton and spandex and um pre-shrunk really great fabric the pr i have three pairs remaining um it could be one young lad who really loves plaid but that rhymes <laughs> young lad who loves plaid uh three pairs of size small i have and these were regularly 21.95 but if i take 40 percent off that brings them down to 13 dollars and 17 cents come on mom grandma let's get these out of here so let me know if you'd like the uh, plaid boxer shorts the other thing we have in size small, men's small, from Little Blue House, we have out of this uh, great lightweight but really quality um, jersey fabric. Again, cotton and spandex with the really wide and comfortable waistband. We have um, these pajama pants, and they also have, who doesn't love pajama pants that have pockets in them so they have pockets and the price of these i have how many pairs do i have remaining i have two pairs and they were 38.95 take 40 percent off 
and that brings them down to $23.30. Pretty decent. You could get some Christmas shopping done, folks, or um, those children and grandchildren uh, spend time out at the cottage camp. They would look great in those. They're just lounging around anywhere. The other thing in terms of boxer shorts, again, size small, uh, is are these. So these are a pair of boxer shorts and uh, by Hatley. And if somebody is into skiing, those are fun. Hot dog, it says on the back side. And these were, um, I have two pairs of these. They were $19.95, take 40% off. That's $11.97 for the hot dog um, boxer shorts. And again, in size small. Okay, somebody who wears size small is just, you know, you hit the jackpot here with us tonight from the brand Woolrich. This amazing flat, um, flannel plaid um, pajama pant with both an elasticized waist and a draw cord. It too has pockets. Price of this was originally $54.95, but because it's part of winter stock, it's 50% off. It's just gonna be $27.48. I have two pairs of these. Okay, so if you'd like those, please let me know. I know some of you are watching and wishing you had a, um, a young lad in your home that wore those but you know it could also be a tall young gal who isn't fully mature well, those would fit very well as well so um moving on uh we have a couple of other sale items with father's day coming up and in mind and we have in from old guys rule which is a quality brand of t-shirts that uh, we've carried for in the past years, but we just have down a couple of items. This is a, just a top, top quality cotton shirt. It's a size medium. And um, on the reverse of it, you can say, see old guy's rule. It says, attract the big ones, satisfaction guaranteed. But it says, old guy's rule, fishing lures, a man without a, a man with a lure. Okay, so men love these shirts. The color is sort of a, a light green, sort of a celery, not quite celery, but a light green color. And uh, the sh price of this is regularly $29.95, 40% off, $17.79 for old guy's rule t-shirt. And I am getting a sense that tonight's show is competing with election night and so many graduations and things going on. And if you're watching the repeat, I'm going to guess many of these products are going to still be remaining available to you. So reach out to me in by, I shall put you, you can text me. That's how you can get in touch with me or phone me. And the number there is 807-628-4334. That's 807-628-4334. So um, we also have in size double X. And it's general generous sizing. So in double X, we have this one. And on the reverse, it says naturally aged, full bodied. And so, uh, yeah, that is a full body in double X. So in the front of the shirt, plus, oh my goodness, they give you a sticker. And I'm sure that'll end up on a bumper um, or uh, some place that just somebody wants to make a statement that old guys rule we're going to have to get one that er, that some, says something about old gals what do you think i'm going to come up with a line <laughs> and um so let me just get back into comments there and um okay so um carrying on some what we have we're going to go a little longer in the show tonight folks because i have a number of items and we're sort of getting wanting to get the store clearance sale, some of the items tidied up here. So let me continue on with bug season. You're looking for gifts for men or for yourself as well. What we have are um, from uh, UST, we have a, you can see there, the photograph. We have, except he doesn't have 
his hood up covering his face, but it's a bug jacket and bug pants that have adjustable um, uh, closures on the wrists, on the bottom of the jacket. And the hood comes up, but there's a zipper so you can remove the front panel so you can eat <laughs> or do what you have to do as he's you see he has not on his face but um the pants also have a draw cord at the waist as well as the ankles it's a black fine mesh that um meshes like this and it doesn't allow the no seams to come through so we are going to be in for a nasty bug season i would think with all the water we've had and um whether it's mosquitoes or black flies or no seams, you're going to want to have one of a set of these around. This is a size large, extra large in a men's sizing. So it's quite large on me. I'm kind of uh, um, not filling it out very well, <laughs> but in a pinch, I'd certainly uh, wear it. For me, the jacket goes uh, covers the bottom of my backside. It's uh, in that sizing, but I can certainly um, cinch it up with the draw cords and um, uh, be getting that coverage. A uh, set is $39.95. So another great item. And uh, with the summer months coming up and Father's Day and heading out to the camper cottage or just uh, in the backyard doing some gardening. There's another product that we have. I just got a new shipment in because this is really practical and um who rather than using um, bug um, sprays, repellents, using a product like this will be appreciated. What is this? This is from Benz and it's called Avisinet, Invisinet. It's a, let me just get focused on that. And it is uh, to cover your head. Uh, bug net. So I just discovered I have one of these left. What is this from Outdoor Research? It is a, a fabric that's going to offer some extra cooling and it is a, a visor, a woman's visor. Got a bit of a stretch. So you would wear this product usually with a hat, a ball cap, and just put it on like this and you are going to protect the bugs yourself from the bugs with this black fine mesh too i'm able to see quite nicely and uh, if this was just um, i was just buttoned up i would be quite safe without um, any insect repellent if you however have a big brimmed hat Unfortunately, that brim doesn't fit in here. So what I would do is put this on first and then put that hat over top of. So uh, great bug, bug protect, protection and the price is just $14.95. So you can't go wrong having a few of the, those at your home. And um, if you're interested in, in the cap, it is uh, the final visor that we have from Outdoor Research. Its price is... Um, $29.95 so and it's nice and compact you can just have it in your pocket so I know we have a lot of golfers out there and uh, people that would just like to have that brim and the coolness so carrying on with the show is um, from uh, in the new shipment came more of the, the company had been sold out for a poor, uh, period but it seems that um, uh, They've got a new shipment in of the Benz Tick Repellent. This is um, uses Icaridin. Uh, Icaridin is the ingredient. It's an alternative to DEET. DEET has been found to be extremely effective against insects and so on. But DEET is a little worrisome because it is carcinogenic. And so you need to be using it sparingly. This is a product that was developed in Germany by the company Bayer. And um, it has approval from the World Health Organization and in terms of its usage. Um, and the Canadian 
there's a Canadian association that is um, deals with um, tropical diseases and so on, suggesting that this is a product that can be used on children as well. And um, but it has the same effectiveness as DEET. So it is for repelling ticks for 12 hour use. And the price of this is $19.95. So let me know if you'd like some Ben's tick repellent. Um, because ticks, uh, uh, some types of ticks that are more and more common and uh, give Lyme disease, can, which can be dehabilitating for a lifetime. So you want to protect yourself if going into the bush. Um, you're going to want to inspect yourself after being outdoors there. They like to go behind your in your hair, behind your ears, um, uh, behind your knees, in the area of your groin, under your arms, and so on. So you'll want to, um, did I just scratch? Uh, it has nothing to do with, <laughs> I think just talking about bugs <laughs> makes me scratch. <laughs> um, so um, then we have that. The other thing we have is, bring some attention to the Nalgene bottles. This is, uh, this. the sticker comes off once you, uh, uh, take away the protective uh, packaging, but uh, this is a limited edition Nalgene bottle in plaid for those plaid lovers. Um, and Nalgene, this is BPA proof, uh, BPA free, uh, break proof bottle with a leak proof wide mouth um, a lid. And that allows you to easily clean this as well as add ice cubes and so on. So these are durable, durable, and a great little gift for somebody who loves plaid. $21.95 for this. One of my favorite bottles, though, you might see me having one here at the store, but uh, I have a new color, <laughs> sort of a orange, bright orange, coral, bright coral color easily visible and um, it's a bottle like this and this is called on the fly bottle it too is out of this um, break proof leak proof uh, break proof bottle which is leak proof but uh, it also has a cap that you can unclip it press the button and it releases it and so you have a drinking spout if you wish I, however, prefer to drink out of a glass, so I just unscrew this, and it's just a really nice size for me. It fits comfortably in my hand. This would fit into a bicycle carrier. It would fit into a automobile cup holder. It's easy to put ice in it, easy to do cleaning, and another feature that I really like about this is I can safely carry it like this. So as I'm carrying things, I can carry my water bottle easily. And I've had them that last for years. But I, I like the color, the fact that this has now come in an orange color. And I'm reminded by some of my staff uh, years back who really creative, oops, creative types. And uh, said, oh my gosh, look at this, Diane. And they would take a light. And I looked around the store for a light, and I should mention that we have these lights. These are uh, LED lights that have three settings, a bright, a bright setting, a lighter setting, and a strobe. And they have a clip, strong clip, a carabiner type style. And the plastic is USB. Um, hmm. Oh, I forgot, ABS. Plastic, plastic, which is what they make Legos out of or what they make um, computer keyboards because of the strength. But these can clip onto your pack, onto, you, onto your belt, a zipper, a dog collar. Anyways, I thought, oh my God, I think it was Sean who used to work for me, who is now, I'm proud to say, a pediatrician. I got his start here in my store. I'm very proud of that. But uh, he would do things like this. Put this in here and now you have a floating lantern outdoors that's pretty neat so you have a waterproof uh, floating lantern oh, look at this maybe it doesn't come across as well so 
this would just float and you could have this attached to your boat at night and uh, you could do it if you did so that would give you an orange light but isn't that sort of a, a cool idea i used to have my staff do something sort of say okay there's a product and here was the intended use can you come up with alternative uses so we can give really people a uh, great value for a dollar and um so that is another use for both the uh carabiner light which was 595 but during our store closing sale they're 15 percent off so just 506 so around five dollars will get you these i have them available in the blue color in red and in black for those lights these uh, water bottles, and these are called Nalgene on the fly water bottles. So uh, these are priced at $21.95 as well. Um, I'm going to just quickly do, okay, I know I'm running over time, but uh, our numbers are hanging tight. I know there's uh, our, our numbers for this Thursday night are a little down. It is election night, and I know people are either working at the polls uh, or getting out to vote or uh, waiting. I suppose the results will start to come in at 9 p.m., but some of the election coverage is starting at 8. So um, what we have here from Outdoors Research is a zip pack. And a zip pack, zip pack, a zip pack is a great sort of um, travel shaving kit or just carrying toiletries you can fit a pair of women's shoes in here anyways or just separate some of your items as you're traveling or just in your pack or uh just you know a great way to give a gift you know fill it up with all sorts of good things it is almost like a parachute material really really durable ripstop nylon from outdoor research it's got two grabs um handles on it and it has here a waterproof zipper and what they do is that they rubberize the um what would normally be the fabric part of the zipper so really compact so lightweight so incredibly durable priced at 30 dollars and some of you know that my store basement on the new addition to my surprise and dismay um uh flooded twice uh in april uh, with with uh, heavy rains that we had and so still cleaning up that mess but when i was in the basement i found this and it uh is a we've been selling a product the loon flute where is the loon flute for most of 25 years we're the first store in canada for many years to carry this product it's developed well let me show you the product not the what i so it's a loon flute, and you can imitate to imitate the four calls of the loon. It um, looks like this, and there is a patent on it, and um, you blow into this end, and as you do, you move this slider back and forth. And on the end of the slider, it'll say, if you can see here, it says whale, tremolo, yodel, and hoot. And there's also numbers and it comes with instructions that'll teach you how to play and i will do you a demonstration but this we used to have in our store before so that's a loon i wasn't sure if it would work because i pulled it out of the water <laughs> but uh, it seems to work so that's what a loon would sound like let me without any oh stop, stop 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 i don't have to, i keep pressing the button because i think i have to turn it off but every time i press the button it just plays more it um so and blow into this end i use my finger here as a little bit of a support i'm going to start with the whale so i line up the word whale with uh this hole i'm going to blow from number one uh, move it from position one to two and to one again Oh, try that again. Hmm. 
not very good tonight. I need to have some supper. <laughs> but anyways, um, May and June, though, you're not to use the loon flute on the lake because that's the nesting and breeding period of the loon and they mate for life and you're just going to mess them up. So you can purchase one of these now, practice indoors, but it come summer months, you can be communicating with the loon. It does come with a fact sheet that'll tell you all sorts of interesting things. You can travel, I believe it's 75 miles an hour. They have a lattice shape rib cage because they dive, I think it's about a hundred feet and at that depth, the uh, rib cage would normally um, collapse. Ours would, but because it's lattice shape, it can withstand that pressure. It's considered a prehistoric bird. All those facts inside here. Price is thirty nine ninety five. Can be a gift for a, a, a gentleman. Could be a gift for yourself. Gift for the kids as they are finishing up school. You're going to be because school's coming up. Here's going to be just two more products. Okay, hang in here, people. Um, what we have is an ice cream ball. Yes, an ice cream ball. An ice cream ball is going to allow you having some fun to make a pint of ice cream. And I'm going to take it out here. What fun this would be. Well, I've got quite a pile of things behind here tonight. So this I'm going to open up. They call this a bit of a kickstand, so when you set it down, it doesn't roll away. But if I open up this side, what I'm going to discover, and it's going to be open. Let me go. There's arrows. I should just need to follow the arrow. Okay. So open is this way. Inside, this is, comes with a recipe book. And in here is where you're going to put your cream and your... You might put some vanilla in here and um, what are the other ingredients? It comes in here. You put you put your ingredients for ice cream in here. There's a recipe. You might put some fruit in there. On this side, what you would do is put rock salt and um, ice in it. And you put the two piece, uh, screw back on the two end pieces and toss the ball. And about uh, 20 minutes of tossing the ball, and turning this around will produce a pint of ice cream. How cool is that? $59.95. And uh, that will keep everyone um, busy as they prep for a nice treat in the summer months. And then finally, 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 as I'm trying to clear things out, is sold a number of these final children's hats from... Uh, but I still have a few left, and we have some bucket hats from Outdoor Research for Children, and uh, this is UPF 30 Plus, Canadian Cancer Society, telling us that 30 Plus is a very great, good sun uh, protection factor, and um, really designed as well as the adults with the infinite, infinite warranty from Outdoor Research. We have a hat like this. This is going to fit... I'm going to show you hats that fit children from age one to three. And this, for example, these are all 50% off. It was originally $26.95, so for $13.50, you're going to get uh, this or your other choices for that one to age three. We have either in white with a gray underside or we have the pastel blue, the little um, pattern underneath. So these hats were, this one was $32.95, and it's half price, so that's $16.50. Can you believe it? And uh, this was $26.95, so that's half price. We also have for ages 1 to 3, just like our really popular Oasis sombreros that we have uh, for women. These will float with a big brim, bigger at the back than the front with an adjustable cord at the back um chin strap in this case it, it will break away uh these hats were normally priced at 35.95 so 36 dollars cut that in half 18 dollars for these okay but what if somebody is younger oh 
I think I have. Oh, okay. My mistake. This first one that I showed you, this little blue one, it's not for one age one to three. It's from newborn to age one. So the, the little wee one, we can do this one. And for age one to three, we can do the Oasis Sombrero style or the bucket hats. But this one is age three to five. It's from a company called Sunday Afternoons. Its price was originally $34.95, so $35, half price $17.50 for this terrific sun hat. So um, those we are clearing out as well. So that is it for the marathon show for Shop with Diane. The, 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 we're sort of getting, trying to get a lot of things wrapped up right now because we have a store closing sale happening. And uh, right now it goes until June the 11th is our final day and our spring summer wear, women's wear is um Spring, summer wear is 40% off and winter wear is 50% off. We have shorts and capris and dresses and we have um, two full racks now of uh, larger sizes, extra double X up to three X. Great selection of clothing. We've never had so much to show and reading glasses from peepers are 50% off. When is the store open? Well, our store hours, we are open Friday, 11 to 5, Saturday, 11 to 4. You can see the hours there. And that goes until June the 11th. So uh, we want you to come in and help us get this stuff out the door. Thank you so much for joining us this evening for the 103rd episode of Shop with Diane. I'd very much love to take your orders in the comments section this evening during the live presentation. Or if you reach out to me and phone me and text me, um, that's another way to get in touch with me. My phone number is 807-628-4334. That's 807-628-4334. If you haven't voted, I think you've got a half hour to get to the polls if you're in Ontario. And um, otherwise, uh, please, everyone, please stay safe and um, come on into the store. Join me. I'm going to, it's going to be really tough. I'm going to be in the final days of my uh, store closing sale, but I'm going to pull out a show uh, on Thursday night. You can see how I'm doing. <laughs> and uh, I know I'm going to collapse after that, but uh, I really appreciate all of your um, support. And um, tell your friends, please, we need to, we've come together as such an, uh, a caring, supportive group. Um, but please reach out to folks, drag them in and uh, introduce them to our great store and uh, love to see you. And uh, I continue to um, send my prayers and best wishes and, and to the folks in Ukraine. And uh, uh, I know we're all distraught by what is happening. And um, uh, yeah, anyways, everyone do take care. We'll see you next week. Bye bye. And I have to figure out how to end the broadcast. So I'm going to look on my screen. It says end broadcast. I'll hit that.